What's up guys, welcome to Lativa's Python tutorial. In the last video we have talked about the object and the attribute of class. And today we are going to talk about inheritance of class. At first, we set a class A with its function. And then we set a class B and the attribute of class B we set a class A. And then the class A becomes parents class and class B becomes child class and the class B will inherit the function of class A. Alright, it is very simple, right? And let's demonstrate it and you will understand it more. At first, we set a parent class. For example, class car. And we set a function of class. Divide init self. And we print let's go car and we set another function in class car defining start and self and we print car start and we define stop function and print car stop and then we are going to set child class class tesla and the attribute of class tesla we set a car and it becomes a child class and the class car becomes parents class and then we defining the function in Tesla init and print let's go Tesla and we set another function method and print Tesla go and we define another function charging print it's charging And all of the function, we are going to set the object. For example, red equals Tesla. And we execute it. And you will see, let's go Tesla. And then, if we add super function with init function, and what will happen let's see it outputs let's go car and let's go tesla because the super function and init function let the class tesla inherit the function of class car so it prints let's go car and let's go tesla all right let's set another function for example red start and execute it it outputs Tesla go although there is a star function in the class car but in priority it will output the function of child class first so it print Tesla go of the star function in class Tesla all right and then we call the star function it outputs car stop because there is no stop function in class Tesla. So the class Tesla will inherit the function of class car and it print car stop. And then we call the charging 
function and execute it it outputs it charging all right it is very simple right today we have talked about the inheritance of class if you like this video please click thumbs up share this video and subscribe see you next time